Oh, hello, hello, my beautiful wolf pack. Ow! Welcome, welcome. If you're new, please hit that subscribe. Hit that bell button so you could get the notifications. Hit those likes, and I appreciate if you share. I thank you for joining me. Today is the person on your mind. I hope you guys caught the reading, the general reading, the love reading, um, the work and money. And I started a new video this year. Um, remember, I, I don't know if you guys heard or remember that I mentioned that for the new year, I'm going to come up with something, a new topic. So the new topic is who's coming towards you. Okay, so we're going to see who's going to come towards you for that week, for that month, for that year, whatever that means. Okay, so we're going to try that one. But um, I hope you guys caught that one. And um, if you like it, please feel free to leave a comment. Let me know if, if you want me to continue with those readings. But I'm going to continue to see how they, you know, how they play for, the, for at least a, a month. All right, so please feel free, leave a comment, let me know, give me your feedback. I appreciate, especially the ones that have left comments or comment because I always get one or two, but I thank you, the ones that are one or two, okay? Thank you so much for your support and your patience, especially. Anyway, so let's continue. Um, I'm not gonna do, uh, a couple of times already I've done the regular cards, which I call my regular cards for the person on your mind. I try the psychic cards and I try the kippers. This time I'm, I'm gonna try the romance cards. We're gonna go with that and let's see how that goes. If it doesn't, and I've, I don't feel like it's going well for me or like I feel like I connect, um, then I'll go back to the regular cards, okay? We're gonna go back to the regular cards. But today we're going to use the romance cards for the person on your mind. Let's see how that goes, okay? So let's clear the negative energy around us. So if you're only catching the video today, you didn't catch the other ones. I wanted to show you these little boxes when my daughter gave me for Christmas. And a couple of other little things like that um, vase where it has cards in it with the moon, the sun, the lovers, and the death card. This one holds my cards, as you can see. And um, she gave me a cup that says local witch. So I, I appreciate my little baby girl. Well, she's not so little, but to me, she's always little. Okay, I just wanted to share that with you. Um... If you're joining me for TikTok, please. Um, I know a lot of people that read tarot on TikTok and a lot of people that like to hear these type of readings. So please share it. So anyone that would love to hear these readings can come in and join us and be part of the Wolfpack. Okay. Um, we are using the rose corks because, you know, I was telling you guys that the rose corks is the best um, crystal for you to um, use for when it comes to your heart chakra. To open your heart, to heal your heart, to, um, you know any negative things that are you had arguments or you had a fight with or a loved one this will help you clear it up this will clear it up okay especially if you clean clean this one with a clear corks leave it 24 hours and clean it and let all the negative stuff out of it and then it's brand new all right so i just thought i'd share that with you but we're gonna put it here on the table i'm sharing it with you guys today um the black tourmaline is still here so anybody dealing with mental emotional physical spiritual whatever issues you have let that bring you some healing okay so we're gonna ask my beautiful guys to please bless and protect the space i ask that you ensure only trust where the answers come from the divine through these cards i ask that you let me see hear feel and know the messages you have for my wolf pack and i ask that this reading brings blessings to everyone involved so it is so be it okay, let's see what messages you have here remember i'm still gonna do the same thing um Try to get the side of what they're thinking about, right? What they're thinking about you. And then this side will be of uh, their actions. What are the actions going to be? The middle will be, of course, the advice and the outcome. We're going to try it that way. All right? All right. Here we go. And guys, if you hear any noises in the background, uh, I apologize. Although my windows are closed because it's cold here. But I live in the city. So you're going to hear a lot of noises in the back. messages you have here for the wolf pack for the person on the line let me shuffle real good because i've never used these for this reading so let's see come on let's pick it up pick it up you let me know when i have to stop please and thank you okay one more here we go what messages you have here for my wolf pack for the person on their mind please and thank you let's get it what are they thinking hmm. Oh, what are they thinking? There goes two of them. Coming out quick. We got a lot to say. Let's go. Okay, 
you know, I take four cards, the top and the bottom. Because <clears throat> then I explain, you know, a couple of little things. All right. One last one for that. Whoa. All righty. And this side is the action. What are their actions going to be? Please and thank you. What are their actions going to be for the person on my wolf pack's mind? What are their actions going to be? Please and thank you for the person on my wolf pack's mind. Ooh, that's three of them. So no, if it comes out for you, then it's for you. No. Alrighty. All right, I saw this one, so I'll put it here. And that, but not least. What are their actions? Please and thank you. What are the actions for this reading? All right. And then we're going to have the advice. What is the advice? Please and thank you. Cool. Okay, it's two of them. So I let a little bonus. And then last but not least, what is the outcome? Please and thank you. What is the outcome for this reading? All right. And we start with the bottom energy, attraction. So your attraction, your, your, um, you attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. So someone here is just enjoying the moment right now because you feel like maybe it's just taking it slow or maybe you're going with the flow right because the bottom one it says worth waiting for so maybe somebody here is patiently waiting either you or that person you know patiently waiting for the for the see she's smelling a flower so maybe you're waiting for the flower to bloom in this relationship like the, the relationship to bloom that could be it right so then we have here Stay optimistic about your love life and keep an open mind. So this person, like I said, they're keeping an open, um, I don't know if they're keeping an open relationship. I hope, you know, if you already know this or find out about it, but I just feel like that, um, what they feel is they're keeping an open, how can I say, like I said at the beginning of flow, like going with the flow. The, um, no, nothing is being rushed here, I feel. I pick up, you know, they're, they're being optimistic. They're trying to, you see how she's smelling the flowers here and here they're, they're um, giving it. So maybe now it's like taking their time, going with the flow, keeping an open mind could mean that they're, again, someone here is exploring. Um, but, you know, they still are with you or they still want to be, to be with you because, again, there's an attraction here, right? We started with the attraction at the bottom. So we have here past life relationship and honeymoon okay so again a person you've dealt with look you have known each other and then this is the honeymoon meaning a new beginning so maybe this is what it's going towards right um or it could mean a past i just picked up real quick um if you're not with this person of course if they you're thinking about them this is a person of course that's from your past that's probably coming in and trying to give their thoughts is probably giving you a new some something new because they still have attraction for you they still have attraction for you. I don't want to hear it. Whether they say no. Okay? They still have that passion. They still have attraction for you. Um, so let's see what are the actions. Express your love and reconciliation. What did I just say? I am so done with these. You see, I'm glad that I picked these cards this time. Hello. Okay, so maybe the, that's what their action is going to be. Now they're going to come forward. They're going to say it, right? Or again, it could mean the relationship. Like I said maybe you're taking your time. Maybe now it's um, going higher. Now it's expressing more. Hello, right? Or going to another level. Look how the crisis is a, um, a reconciliation, but look how they're floating in the star. I mean, the sky um, with the clouds. So that means it's um, ascending. Like maybe this is ascending to a higher level, of, uh, uh, a notch, uh, like bringing it up a notch. Look, soulmate, I am done. Because you deserve love. You are lovable. Okay. Again, this person is attracted to you. They have an attraction. Again, it, it, maybe they could be with someone at the moment. I hope not. But if that's the case, when they and they're like separating and they, um, yeah, this person could mean that could see you as a soulmate. How about that? They see you as a soulmate. But reconciliation could mean again a person that you have been with from the past. They're coming back to express their love, you know, staying optimistic, staying, you know, keeping an open mind because they feel you are the soulmate, right? Mm, this is a this is a real tight connection with somebody. So let's see what what is the advice with this situation. Let your friends help you, and very soon, I'm done. 
So maybe you have friends in common, you have somebody in common that could get, uh, probably relate a message or they're going to relate a message to you. Because I feel that this very soon means that this person is probably going to ask someone in their circle or somebody that you guys know mutually or family, you know, it could be friends that, that you have a, a cousin that's that's a, like your best friend. So it could mean that too. You're going to have family that's going to come out to you. So just probably wait for, I feel like somebody needs to wait right now for a message. If you are separated now, if you're together with this person and you're in your mind, then this is going to another level. You're going to another level. It's going to be very soon. Just keep, be patient because like I said, go with the flow at the beginning. There is attraction here. Okay, so, but take your time. Take take your time. The honeymoon will be in, in the future. Soulmate. And then this is the action. I'm sorry. This is the um, the outcome. And it's make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. What did I just say? Steps. So steps is taking it, your time. Taking it step by step. But some making that effort. So if you're putting the effort in, that person has to put the effort in. It has to be mutual. Because if you're putting effort and they're not, then that's not the one. Now if you're if they're putting an effort and you're not, then the, the balance is not right. So you have to put make the effort. If that person is making the effort, that's showing you. Not just talk, but actions. Okay? I just feel like I needed to tell you that. So real quick, I'm gonna give you um the last one is here, the notes from the from the universe. On love and connection. So let's see what last message they have here for you. Oh, I got goosies when I said the last thing, so I don't know why. But here we go. One last message, please and thank you. One last message, and I ask that this card brings breath blessings to everyone involved. So it is, so be it. Okay, one last message, please and thank you. You have your phone my wall. Alright, here we go. And it says, give yourself much more credit. Okay. A stranger than strange preponderance to ponder. I believe I said that right. Those in great relationships aren't always those who are good at relationships. <laughs> I swear. Oh, it's preponderance. Okay, sorry. A now, I'm going to start it again. A stranger than strange preponderance to ponder. Those in great relationships aren't always those. Sorry, this light is sucks. And those who are good at relationships. And those in challenging relationships aren't always those who are bad at relationships. Oh, see? Wow. Even though I use preponderance ineptly this one is really good please ponder what did i say take your time didn't i say i don't make this up people i'm telling you okay but hey if this resonates with you you take it with you you put it in your pocket if it doesn't you leave it behind for someone else to fill their pockets so take care now love and light Ow! bye bye and happy new year